everyone, welcome to another video. My name is Evil and actually in today's video we are going to count on top 10 best racing games for the rush of adrenaline in you. Just before we dive to the video, I really appreciate it if you click on the subscribe button and like the video for more videos like this. Let's dive to the video. Okay, number 10, Sonic and All-Stars Racing Transform Collection. Kart racing is a genre defined by wild arcade style driving. Wacky power-ups designed to take up rival races or shield you from their attacks. Twisty tracks and twisty characters. Sonic and All-Star Racing Transform Collection is no different except that you battle on land and in the air and water. Oh, and it features an incredible cast of saga characters. The Wacky Racer featured the Sonic character family. Sonic, Amy Rose, Eggman, Knuckles, Tails, plus many others plucked from Saga's rich arcade and console history. For example, you can rev in giants using Alex Kidd in Miracle World. Number 9 Ridge Racer Unbound. The Ridge Racer series may not carry Gran Turismo or Forza swagger in the contemporary video game market, but the long running franchise has dedicated fan base that loves the drift centric racing action. This entry, crafted by Bug Beer Entertainment, brings a chaotic element to the familiar gameplay by adding environmental and vehicular destruction as you race for street cred in the fictional Shatter Bay. It's Ridge Race Gun Full Burnout. Shatter Bay's many districts are high detailed and destructible locations that entice you to race one more match. When you fire up Ridge Race Unbound, you can only select one car and race the streak, but others are unlocked as you accumulate collateral damage points. These points are gathered by plowing through anything other than a solid brick wall. Number 8 Need for Speed Heat Need for Speed Heat is a thrilling racing game that mostly nails the elements that made previous NFS entries so successful. Solid racing mechanics, excellent car customization options and over the top cop chases. The game has a cool day and night mechanic that let you embrace brighter daytime racing scenes as well as high stakes underground racing at night. Palm City looks great in evil light and gives the game visual variety. The character customization and improved narrative also make the game more enjoyable than the last few entries. Despite the lackluster multiplayer mode and some unclear controls, series fans could not hesitate to pick up this one. When you're ready, switch into night. Number 7 Lego 2K Drive. If you want a racing game that completely ditches realism in favor of pure imagination, pick up Lego 2K Drive. After all, it's literally about toy cars. Although not a totally open world game, this arcade racer sets you free in a variety of large open zones. As you drive around this beautifully blocky vault, you'll compete in races. Your logo contraption can seemingly transform between a car and an off-road vehicle and a boat. Between the boosting power-ups and a chaotic sense of speed, you'll feel out of control in the most fun way possible. As a LEGO game, LEGO 2K Drive also gives you a robust tools for customizing your car down to the brick. Granted, this also ties into the game's bothersome micro transactions but there are some microtransactions is still if a full on lego version of forza horizon sounds appealing lego 2k drive is worth a purchase number six hotshot racing Hotshot Racing replicates 1990s era arcade style driving competitions with its pickup and play control champ and angular low polygon visual aesthetics. In many ways, the title developed by Lucky Mountain Games with an assist from racing masters at Sumo Digital captures the retro racing vibe mostly. Although the brightly colored Hotshot Racing looks like a game from an Autoron era, it lacks the thrilling level design that makes many retro racers so memorable. That's not to say that Hotspot Racing isn't a good time, it most certainly is. Drift lovers will dig the power slide in focused gameplay. Number 5 
Horizon Chase Turbo. These days, it's easy to adopt technical stance toward anything laced with nostalgia because there are so many pop culture properties mining the past for a quick buck. Somehow, some way, Horizon Chase Turbo, despite its throwback Isaac, has charm enough to prevent it from being lumped into that hack class. Horizon Chase Turbo is a simple game that focuses on boosting, weaving between rebels' vehicles, and a unique gameplay angle, collecting gas canisters so that you don't run out of the field. That said, the Aquarius Game Studio published racing games man hookies its values. Horizon Chase Turbo is a gorgeous game through admittedly one that may not be instantly recognized such as a due to the flat polygon heavy art style and re that recalls 1990s racing games. But with the jaggies, clipping and other era specific visual flows, the graphics dance between pastels, colors and cool neon high loss depending on if you are driving at daytime or nighttime respectively insanely cool to look at and just as fun to play horizon chase turbo is a pc racing game that belongs in your library number four for zaros and five each sequel in Xbox Game Studios' popular racing series uses a previous title as a foundation, and Forza Horizon 5 continues the tradition. The fifth title in the racing and music festival has numerous mods, fun atmosphere, hip music, and wild stunts you expect, but this time the additions and changes are more evolutionary than revolutionary. Long-time series fans will appreciate Forza Horizon 5 varied Mexico setting, ridiculously packed modes, and new features. Newcomers will be involved by the racer's many creative riches. In short, Forza Horizon 5 remains the best racing game series, and Forza Horizon 5 is yet another example of why it's so beloved. And number three, yeah, Forza Horizon 4. In, in 2018, Forza Horizon 4 appeared on PC just two years after its excellence predecessor, which made some people question the necessity of the series ever other year schedule. Yet developer Playground Games thought that open war racers new features would make the purchase worthwhile the company was 100% correct with Forza Horizon 4 the thrilling racing and music festival formula expands new vehicles fresh and addictive solo and multiplayer mods and seasonal effect the changing weather patterns are easily the game's best aspects as they alter how to approach driving for example the scenic lake that you visit by driving the springs and summer and fall may freeze over the winter allowing you to drive over it as an alternative route likewise spring rains modest courses making you know cornering a chore the seasons shift every week so you aren't stuck in one for too long factor in a new performance enhancing skills gorgeous uk based environments returning barn finds well created soundtrack and forza horizon 4 4 stands as one of the best racing games to appear on pc in recent years Number 2, Dirt 5. The Codemasters developed Dirt 5 harkens back to 1919s, a time when McRae Rally and Sega Rally Championship elevated extreme racing games. Like those games, Dirt 5 isn't concerned with realism or deep customization options. Instead, the rally racers want you to barrel your way to victory on winding mud-covered tracks. While Dirt 5 isn't wholly original, it succeeds at de delivering a loud, colorful racing experience for folk looking for a PCP with high-speed escapades. Actually, just before we dive to the last one, I really appreciate it if you like the video and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you, my name is Avalon, let's dive to the video. And number one, Burnout Paradise Remastered. 
Burn Out Paradise originally released in 2008 for PC and PlayStation 5 and Xbox 360. It's one of the Criterion's best games, so it only makes sense that Burn Out Paradise Remaster is even better. On top of some welcome graphics enhancements, PC players get to experience the previously console only Big Surf Island and all its potential for stunts and havoc. Paradise City's map is as enjoyable as ever too, whether you are just driving around or completing a many available events. Although some of the original game's pain points remain, knowing crash cam, some menu quirks, none are severe enough to seriously detract from the title satisfying vehicle handling, expansive map and many unblockable. My name is Abolan, thank you for watching this video.